Welcome back. Well, last week we brought you an incredible, quite in-depth interview with the great man, the Dark Knight, the Black Knight, Gary Player. And of course, he was incredibly excited about the Gary Player Invitational, which kicked off at Sun City this weekend. A wonderful opportunity, yes, to um, go and spend some time with some incredible celebrities, see some brilliant golf. All of that aside, it is also a wonderful opportunity to break the bank when it comes to charitable donations. And this year, I think, would be no different. Time for a bit of an update on some of the action that happened out on the course and to find out how much money was raised in what promised to be a stellar weekend. As it has been doing for the better part of two decades now, the Gary Player Invitational brings business, golf and celebrity together to raise funds for the underprivileged all around the world. This weekend marks the South African leg of the event and everybody here is excited for a fun-filled weekend here in Sun City. With over half a billion rand raised thus far, the Gary Player Invitational is the country's premier golf fundraising tournament. So happy to be back. You know, obviously uh, very lucky to have been asked back, you know, get, uh, got invited again back at, uh, as defending champion. It's lovely to be here and uh, got more uh, competition again next year, uh, this year with, uh, with Mark and Jacques this year. So just that gives it a bit more of a spin, I think, this year. Oh, it's amazing. This is my fourth time coming here for the Gary Player Invitational and it's, again, another great honor to be back and hopefully this year we can raise even more money. But that's what Uncle Gary's always been about, um, longevity, consistency, and that's what happens 15 years later and time flies like this, you know? It's consistent, man. It's a quality brand to be associated with. And all I need to do is just play my part. This year, the tournament celebrates its 15th anniversary of giving. So I think what Gary Player is doing um, for the charity is amazing. Um, I played in the Invitational at Wentworth and it was a fantastic event. So I'm really excited to be here this week. I hope that they realize that we can at least five million. I really do. I think that's a good goal. If we can go over five million, we all will be very pleased. But I think with Mr. Gary Player's involvement and it's the 15th year, who know they can go to a much higher figure. And I really hope they will. The tournament at the Lost City at Sun City marks the final leg of the Invitational, which is also held in the United States, Abu Dhabi, China and Europe respectively. The past two weeks I've been practicing like you would never believe because I don't want to be that guy. Longest day on the course, you don't want that at the Gary Play Invitational. Herschel's only defending champion because he was here with his ex-girlfriend here last year. So he was focused last year. This year he's come here as a single man. <laughs> He's not going to come close to the scoreboard. <laughs> Who's Herschel Gibbs? I've never heard of him. <laughs> I, I know Herschel quite well. Uh, he's been in my house and he's a good friend. And I think there's other people that maybe can bump him a little bit. But, you know, he plays good golf. And if the four will with him are good golfers, I think it's going to be a big task to bump them off this pedestal, for sure. So with Herschel Gibbs returning to defend his title and former pro tiers Jacques Cullis and Mark Boucher eager to topple their fellow Springbok legend, this can only mean we're in for a weekend of competitive jousting for bragging rights.